Okay, so I am trying color straight nail strips for the first time and I am, this is my first time, I haven't done my own nails in probably years. I never do my own nails, so just as a disclaimer, so I'm going to try and see if this is actually something that anybody can do or you have to have a special talent or skill when it comes to nails. So this is the color that I'm going with. I, I bought several colors online, but this is my favorite one. I can kind of see it. And this is what my nails look like right now. Uh, they don't have anything on there, so I'm just going to go ahead and get started and do a whole demo on it. So this is the packet it comes in. I got this from Melissa, one of my favorite YouTubers. So I'm going to open it up. You know what? I think I need scissors. So this what comes in the pack. Two nail strips. And then these color street pads. You just use these to kind of clean your nails before you get started. And this, I heard that this is not good to use. It's better to use your finger from some of the videos I've been watching. But I might try to do both and see what happens. So I'm going to start by... It just says directions before applying color straight. Wipe each nail with a pad. So I'm just gonna go ahead and wipe each nail. I think you gotta let it dry for like 60 seconds or something like that before you get it started. Um, and see, I, you can't, you probably can't. I just took gel nails off, but it looks, see that indent? I don't know if they just didn't take it off good enough or gel nails always damage my real nail. Doesn't matter what place, what nail salon I go to. So I always take a break. Like I'll do it for a couple months back to back and then I'll take a couple months break. So I've been on a break for a couple months and then I started back in December and I've, I had them on for four weeks. They look, they look pretty good, honestly, for four weeks. It was just new growth and I had one chipped. Well, I only needed one strip. I might save that other one. I don't know if you're supposed to use one from one hand or not, but anyway, I'm gonna go get some scissors to open up this little pack. Cause I forgot, I didn't think about that. So I'll be right back. But yeah, I just clean them. I'm gonna let them air dry as I go get um, and film. Unprepared, I don't have my scissors, so hold on. So I got, I gotta get a better position. All right, so scissors, I'm gonna open up the pack. Pretty simple. And, okay, so it comes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight different sizes. I think this is more for your big toe on your feet. I think, cause I'm just looking at it the second, I mean, maybe even this one I could use on my thumb and then kind of go down. I don't know if this might be too small for my pinky. So I'm just gonna take off one because I might end up using both just depending. You can smell it, it smells like nail polish. Um, all right, I'll, I'll set that aside, I'll do that later. All right, so. This is the back of it and then this is the front and basically I'm gonna try to size okay this one definitely is a thumb mm, that might be too big this one's definitely so sorry I try to show you guys so this one definitely goes for this finger this is definitely a thumb finger so I'm gonna skip this one this one this middle one definitely goes here. 
hair and that is too small for my pinky so this one is too small for my pinky so i'm gonna use this one for my pinky so basically i'm gonna go this this one wait one one two three four five this one is too small this one doesn't seem to fit anything and this is so those are probably good for your feet because when you get really good with this from what i've heard you get two strips so this is enough for two manicures and a pedicure and it i can't remember the price there they ran from 11 to 13 or 14 dollars i think this one might have been 12 or 12 or 13 for this one strip so for 13 bucks three basically manicure pedicure is a really good deal all right, so, yeah, all right, so we're gonna try my thumb. Let's go with the thumb first. So I'm gonna use this one for the thumb. I just, it was easy peel off. And I, th I think the way you can do it is one like this way and the other way. So maybe I should read it. I'm not, I'm horrible at reading directions. Okay, it says easy, remove the clear cover. Okay, remove the clear cover. Peel the polish strip. So remove this top part, then peel this part. Then take the tab off, apply to the nail, file the access. So, okay, so this is what we're gonna do. Take off the top. If this doesn't work, we'll try the other set. <laughs> so take off this little top part and then you see the smell it. it smells good and then take off the back I'm gonna try and hmm. this back seems to be a little bit harder okay maybe I um, yeah I'm doing it wrong okay I don't want to touch it I don't know if it's wet or not but remove the clear color, peel the polish strip. Oh, it says tear the back end, apply to nail and gently fit to stretch. I know you have to peel this back part off. I'm just not doing it right. So see, this is a real live demonstration. Hmm. All right, I'm gonna have to figure this out. Okay, I think. All right, I got it. It's a little difficult to get off. You have to really, let me show you guys why I've been struggling. I don't know if you can see it. So you have to really peel that part <laughs> off to get it right. Okay, so then you peel, peel it off like this and I'm using this for my thumb. So that's kind of what it, what it looks like. Okay, so I don't wanna mess it up too much. So they say apply it. So I'm gonna to try to show you and do it at the same time. Let's see how this works. Apply it to the back part. Lay it flat like that. Then you kind of wanna make it, there we go. And then you have to, you have to smooth the edges. And then kind of, yeah, kind of smooth the edges. See how I'm smoothing. Ooh, you have to be really, really careful. So, you wanna, cause you don't want any bubbles or any air pockets. So you wanna, and some people say they can do this in 10 minutes and I'm looking at my time and it's nine minutes and 36 seconds right now. So it took me, nine minutes just to do that so it's probably a 20 minute video so i'm just trying to oh okay now this is the tricky part now once you have it on tearing it so you can use the other side for the other thumb so i'm gonna they say take your nail and press against it so that's what i'm gonna 
like bend it over, see, bend it over the thumb and press. They say press it and then press it like this and it should come, say so it should tear right off. And it, and that's what it looks like. And I'll have to file that part down. I'm gonna try to quickly see if I can apply this side. If it doesn't work, I'll take it off really quick. So I'm gonna, my nails almost, and I'm, let me stand up so I could probably give you guys a better view. Are almost. Uh, see that side? It's not covering it. And I don't know what the difference is. Like, so I'll show you guys in a second. So I'm just going to smooth this over. My nails are almost, and I had them cut today are almost too long for one strip to share two nails. And some people say they get one strip, can get two nails and a, and a toe. So I, that definitely varies. And my nails are not even that long. I had them cut and I almost kept them a little bit long, but I do like, I'm sure I had them cut to that. So I'm sorry, I need to better view so I can show. All right, so I'm just kind of smoothing it out, smoothing it out, smoothing it out, smoothing it out, smoothing it out. And then there's barely nothing on here. So I'm just rounding it. I'm just rounding, rounding these edges. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna use a file to do the rest. And so far, I'm only two nails in. My review is this is this is not the same as gel at all. It's, it doesn't even compare. But I think it's more comparable to real nail polish versus gel nail polish. Um, gel is a thicker coat on your nail. So I'm gonna file. I'm just gonna gently file this down like especially like this and in hindsight it's always 2020 right in hindsight i should have did my thumbs last because i'm gonna need them to work on the rest and it might mess up when i'm trying to apply each now so hindsight it's my first time hindsight's always 2020 so, right now I'm just trying to file. I have no filing skills whatsoever. So I'm just trying to do it. And I'm just kind of scraping along to kind of clean, clean them up a little bit. Um, and I think, all right, I def this one definitely needs to, like, I don't know what's going on with this. I think it needs to, yeah, just pieces need to come off. But, I don't know. I don't know how I like it so far. This might only last me a couple days. But I'm only on two now, so I'm gonna keep going. However, I'm committed to the process even if I don't necessarily like it right now. Like I don't, like, I don't know if you can see that clearly. I don't like that, but, and it might honestly be, the, these sparkles might be too much. Too many sparkles might. Yeah, I don't know if it's the filing or the sparkles. That's 
And granted, this is my first time. And I... I, um... I have other colors, so... I've already spent the money on it, so I'm gonna see it through. I don't... See, these sparkles at the bottom are bothering me. And it's... Let me see if I can get a better... It's really hard to tell. I don't know. I have to show you at the end when I lift the camera. But the sparkles are bothering me. So I'm going to leave that. So this video is not 30 minute video on how to apply nails that should only take you 10 minutes. So we're going to keep going. And I got other colors. Camera's messing up. Um, this. These two I want to mix and match. Classic pink. Sparkles. So I'm going to keep putting them on. I, didn't, I bought them so I'm going to use them. But, um, okay, so let's go with the next. So I believe, I say, okay, so here's what I have. This is the big thumb. We're done. I'm not going to use that. So this one I'm going to use, and you just kind of eyeball it out a little bit. And I might even go with 